All right, we're back on Smart Jamaica. It's morning time to talk about roofing. Uh, Cameron Ross is the managing director of Metrotile uh, New Zealand Limited. And Andrew Steinegar is the managing director of Spectrum Systems Limited. I suspect distributing this type of roofing in Jamaica. That's up? Certainly, yes. All right, Andrew, first of all, tell me a, a little bit about the type of roofing that we have. Um, this type of roofing is a stone-coated steel tile. Uh, which is manufactured by Metro Tile of New Zealand. Mm -hmm. uh, Cameron is the person responsible for this. Um, this is our largest product, I mean, our uh, highest volume product for inclined roofs. So this is already in use here in Jamaica? Oh yeah, all over Jamaica. Yeah. We've done a number of large developments with it. Um, you can find this roofing uh, all over the island. Cameron, let me ask you this. Mm -hmm. Conditions in Jamaica and New Zealand are, I suspect, slightly different. Yes. Um, why would a roof that's suitable for New Zealand be suitable here? Well, we manufacture roofing tiles to be suitable for all around the world. And uh, these are very good in hurricane force winds. In fact, they're, they're probably the, 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 the tiles that stay on the roof in the highest wind zone. 120 miles an hour? Yeah. Rated at 120 more. miles per hour. Which would be about a category uh, Gilbert four or got something. up to about 140, and products of this type withstood that very, very well. All right, explain to me the, the, the product though, because I have a. This is a, a tile? That this is, is a one. single tile. That's one tile. So this would go on the roof, zoop, 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 zoop right it. the way down. Mm -hmm. All right, what is different about it? The, apart, I mean, it is metal, but this, yeah. this finish on it is, is what? Natural it's, stone. Okay. Natural stone. So basically on the back it's zinc loom coated steel which is better than galvanized steel. Right. Um, roofing years ago was galvanized and then they mixed aluminium uh, with uh, zinc to make uh, galvanized, uh, sorry, zinc loom. Mm -hmm. um, and then we apply a, uh, an acrylic base coat right. and we put natural stone chips on top of this. So this color here is all natural stone so this won't fade. Uh, the, the orange colors is ceramic coated, same as a china plate and um, the product itself comes with a 50-year warranty. So it's a lifetime roof. It's very lightweight, okay? Yeah. And when it's fixed, it's fixed horizontally. And when hurricane force winds come in, they try and suck it up. It, because it's fixed horizontally, it won't take. Okay. So it's very strong. So there are, there are different colors? Yes, we, we make up to 20 different colors. Okay. But, uh, and, and we stock about five profiles in Jamaica. Yeah. So we have the widest selection of profiles and colors in stock. So how, how does it, I, I don't know anything about roofing. You have what, the wooden structure first? Sure. And then you put this on you top of that? You have the timber framework. Um, then we use typically an underlayment. And then these tiles go on the top. So the lick is hurricane winds come, can't lift it up. But what about hurricane rain and leakage? No, there's no problem with, with, with leaking. And in New Zealand, we get lots of rain. Yeah. Um, we actually export these tiles to over 80 countries around the world. Right. Um, from the snow areas to Africa to Middle East, um, Jamaica, we've got high winds, and we don't have a single problem with leaking. What about the difference between this and an ordinary metal sheet? Yeah. That I, I don't know what they use up there. Or... Um, well, tiles, those metal tiles. sheets are not warranted for 50 years. That's the first thing. Right. And then these are far more attractive. The different profiles are intended to imitate natural materials. Right. So the stone This look one looks like clay tiles, right. as you've seen. Right. This one looks like wood shakes. So you get a far more attractive roof and you get a 50 year warranty. Okay. And this is what it would look like when they're installing yeah, that's it. Installation. Yeah, that's a Richmond project in St. Anne that uh -huh. we're doing now. Um, and uh, that looks is like one of the roofs. it's relatively easy to go on as well. Yeah, very quick. Very yeah, quick. one of those roofs takes about two, three days. And that's, to do. he's nailing it onto the, the, the wooden frame? Onto the two by two battens. Uh, you'll notice a very silver uh, underlayment uh -huh. underneath. That's a heat reflective barrier that so reflects 90% cool. of the sun's radiant heat that would normally enter the house. Now that comes with, that's a part of that's this? That's an optional yes. uh, accessory okay. Okay. that the developers at Richmond insisted on to make the so roofs So you can see how many roofs we've done there. Right. They're beautiful. That's We're using four different colors at that development. And you'll notice how richly landscaped it is. Yeah. So it is, uh, the roofs really blend in well with the whole environment. Look it. Looks neat. Very neat. Yeah. 
I'd suggest you go down. Richmond is right opposite Chococo. Yeah, man, I've seen it. Have a look. I never looked at the road. It's looking before, great. Yeah. Well, now yeah. you know. Yes. <laughs> All right. So, and, and what about cost, not per roof, but in terms of competition? How Very competitively priced. Yeah. Um, half the cost of natural cedar roofing, maybe 80% of the cost of clay tile roofing. So it's very competitively priced. When you consider the low initial cost and the 50-year warranty, right. it's completely maintenance-free, hurricane resistant, fire resistant, earthquake resistant. This product offers you the best value for money that you can get so currently. Clay tiles would uh -huh. be 80% more expensive no. than this one? No, I would say about 20%, depending okay, okay. on the type depending of the clay tile. Clay tile. And this looks a lot like clay tile. Right. I've, I have yeah. myself driven past roofs With this repeatedly and, and, and not knowing Hence that it was our product. The Tuscany. That's a Metro yeah. Roman Tuscany. That comes in about five different colors um, that typify the region around right. the Mediterranean. Right. Uh, okay. So yeah. we have a pretty wide palette of colors available. Okay. We actually have 30 choices. Where are you, by the way? We are in Kingston, uh -huh. two locations. Um, and in Montego Bay and Freeport. Okay. And we maintain very large inventories. Kingston where, brethren? Uh, 7 Union Square, Kingston 5, mm -hmm. and 18 to 20 Third Street, Newport West. And we are at Unit 3 in LOJ Freeport. What about installation? You do all of that as well? Or you just sell the We product? will take on special projects mm -hmm. like we did. We're doing Richmond. Right. Oh, we did Ibero Star. Um, and uh, oh, that's but what's there. Yeah, the Iberostar 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 Star has um, the Once metro again, shingle you look, in weather timber. Yeah, we yeah. Think they probably thought like it was that. a wood yeah. roof. So they, they, um, they choose these roofs for a specific reason, and that's because they know that they stay on very well in hurricane force winds. Right. So uh, that's the high, uh, the the highest rated uh, product for hurricane force winds. Okay. All right. And you say you've got plenty of material in stock. Yeah. We have enough of this in stock to do hundreds of houses okay. at any time. I mean, we have lots of inventory. Okay, excellent. Thanks a lot, uh, uh, Cameron Ross, coming all the way from New Zealand. Thank you very much. About um, Metro Tile uh, New Zealand, the makers mm -hmm. of uh, the roofing products, and of course, available here through um, Spectrum Systems Limited, uh, of which Andrew Stanagar is the uh, managing director, thanks for coming in and uh, thank you very much. Thank you, thanks for the opportunity. All right, we're going to be hearing about um, more building a sports facility out uh, at K Manus, which UDC and UTEC are involved. That's coming up next here on Smile Jamaica.